I, observant guy, and I have observed guys in the gym who are 55 plus fall under two categories. The majority who are apathetic, disinterested, half-assing whatever they do, plopping down on whatever machine they just feel like using that's available or whatever, and the minority, those that still get after it hard, that have that vigor and intensity that is inspiring to guys my age and younger. Hey, look at that guy who's like 60 or whatever who's still pretty jacked and training hard. But I gotta tell you, the guys that fall into that minority category use not all some crappy form oh my god some of them use worse form than noobs like teens except they have you know the muscle mass and the strength that the noobs don't have Duh. but boy oh boy you know when you're older you're more susceptible to injury so you need to be more cognizant of the type of form you use a lot of these guys are dealing with the ego thing you know they're older they've been doing it a certain way and they're not gonna change it doesn't matter there's so much great information out nowadays that a lot of people just don't adhere to, absorb, and uh, just, I don't know. But 30 odd, 40 years ago, there wasn't quite the same information out there. I mean, it was there, but you had to like really seek it out or be lucky enough to meet someone who took you under their wing and helped you out or trained with you or whatever that really knew what they were doing. And if they didn't have that, they had bad instruction, and you throw in time and the ego, well, geez. It's hard to teach an old dog new tricks. So listen, you guys out there that fall into this demographic, it almost seems like uh, subconsciously maybe back there, you want to just rip some stuff up, just hurt it real good so you don't have to be bothered any longer with all this toiling in the gym that you've been doing all this time but you know you're displaying yeah I love her ah. it's like a conflicted kind of situation if you fall into this category this demographic think about what you're doing in the gym how you're doing what you're doing in the gym so you can if you want, if you can, for the next 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, whatever years, continue to do what you do, if you want to. And be that guy who's like 65, 70, 80, whatever, who people will be inspired by. Not just because you're just there and doing it, but because, wow, you're doing it, and you're doing it well, and you're doing it well doing it better yeah because better is vastly underrated